Well, there are thousands of amazing students out there in South Florida schools, but some stand out because they inspire everyone around them. Our new Friday feature will profile one of these extraordinary kids every week. And we are going to call it Swag on Six, students working at greatness. NBC6 reporter Ari Adzer introduces us to a high school senior who oozes <laughs> swag now after overcoming a brutal regimen of chemotherapy. In a school full of shining stars, a kid named Sterling may be setting a new standard for brightness, not to mention courage and perseverance. It's been hard, but I love the challenge. Sterling Velazquez is a senior at the School for Advanced Studies at Miami-Dade College. Didn't awesome. they do that for AP Calc? They did it for AP Calc. Yeah. Everyone here takes college courses. It's a demanding curriculum, and it's exponentially harder if you're battling cancer. Even though he's dealing with a, an illness, he still shows up to school, doesn't use the illness as an excuse, and is able to obtain stellar grades. He's really an inspiration for everyone here. Sterling got the diagnosis two years ago, stage four lymphoma, often fatal, just after he was admitted to SAS. It was devastating at first, but a couple of weeks later, I got up and I just thought to myself, there's no way I'm gonna give up all the hard work that I've been through and just sit in bed all day. So I got up, I went on my computer, and I started signing up for some classes online. I took calculus the whole year on my own, aced that class. He aces everything. If not for missing some school days to get chemotherapy treatments, Sterling would have straight A's. Dealing with this, I had no idea just how hard things could be, and it's something that you can't possibly be prepared for. And he's such an intellectual kid, and seeing that he went through all that and still managed to keep up his academics is amazing. Sterling isn't in the habit of advertising what he's gone through, but there's no question his presence here inspires his classmates. And then you see someone like Sterling, like, pushing himself through everything with all of his problems, which are greater than my problems, at least. And I'm like, well, if he can do it, then I can sure as hell do it. So I guess my message is, even in your lowest moments, just pull through. The cancer treatments weakened his legs, but Sterling will keep moving forward, hoping for an Ivy League future, gaining emotional strength with every step of his journey. In Kendall, Ari Odzer, NBC6 News.